Hello, friends and family. How are you today? Today, we're gonna talk about、uh, guess what's the topic.、Um, we talked about、um, we're gonna talk about、uh, how ancient Chinese people deal with flood and、uh, how long you think Chinese flood will. Um, last so far, and we were gonna talk about how to pick summer class. Um. Oh well. Ended up, one of my kids cried at me. I hate chemistry. Oh no! I hate chemistry. I hate chemistry. Okay. <laughs> Today we're gonna talk about. I hate chemistry. Cause I really did hate chemistry. Um, that kid was asking me questions about、uh, the changing phases of、uh, among gas, solid, and、uh, and liquid, and.、Uh, About chemical reactions and about fusion. Okay, let's talk about those concepts one after another. First of all, changing of phases. That is about changing from. Gas to liquid to、uh, solid, the temperature, the environment, things bump into each other, the gravity, the whole nine yards. That is basic physics, and for that basic physics, it's one year in college. So you do couple quizzes every week, and、uh, at the end of the semester there were probably twenty some quiz something quizzes already, and that's like four months, and then you finish it, finish it up for one whole mes whole semester, for two whole mes semesters. Um, you you learn all all things like、um, the the omega that is、um, speed of all kinds and the、um, the mgh half mv square all all those things. I'm not gonna tell you that you will have time to learn it in college. That is、um, physics, and then for chemistry, it's chemical reaction. What is a benzene ring? You are gonna learn it. We will carefully learn it. Your teacher will spend probably a whole class, whole forty-five, fifty minutes, just tell you. How that benzene ring coming to being? Well, that is only one small molecule, and your teacher will 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 tell you about how those carbon, hydrogens, the water, how they hook together, how they break up. Those are called chemical reactions, and.、Uh, Inorganic chemistry and chem organic chemistry are two different、um, parts. One year, two semester, you do intro to inorganic chemistry one and two. Another year, you do organic chemistry one and two. And next concept I want to talk about is quantum phase. 
quantum physics is um it's about uh, Einstein's law of relativity. Usually, for intro to physics, they they give you a little tip of the quantum phase, and the rest of the quantum phase, of course, you guessed it. That's a college senior class. So fusion means one atom nuclear of an a nuclear of one atom squished into the other nuclear and that fusion there are different kinds of fusions that's how to build a bomb that is supposed to be a college senior class and be young. It's very, very hard. And do you know what? Some kids were taking a chemistry class that asked for all those questions. What is fusion? What is chemical reaction? What is um, what is physical changes and every single one carefully with the detailed questions oh my gosh that's a hard hard class i'm glad you didn't pass that class think about it it's like if you really get that class done with a good grade, you will end up, say, learning it better than a college senior. And then when you go to college, when people see, oh, you learned all those things already. You know what? Just uh, learn some advanced physics or advanced chemistry. The, the 5,000 level class, oh, you can do it in your a freshman year. You tell me how miserable that will be. And you're thinking, go to an international meeting with all kinds of 70s and 80s people, people in their old age. You right. think that is miserable? Yeah, taking a graduate level class in freshman year, that is even worse. So, you don't need to cry about your bad grade in chemistry. If I were taking that chemistry class, I would hate that class too. Oh my gosh, that is so gross. Um, that's what I want to tell you today, kid, friends, family. I love you so much. Um, so, I guess we will talk today. It's it's way too long, almost nine minutes. We'll we'll talk about um, how to pick a summer class next time, um, or how to deal with flood for ancient Chinese people. How they did that. We'll talk about it probably next next time if we get a chance um, so thank you so much for listening if you're still here have a great day be safe and I love you bye bye <laughs>